everyone. I want to show you my back to school haul. I'm going back to school. As you guys know, I'm going to community college. I'm wearing my school shirt today. Um, I bought it and everyone's kind of laughing at me because I bought a community college shirt, but I don't care. I'm, if I'm gonna, I'm, I have the mentality, if I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do it like full 100%. So I bought the shirt. I am gonna try out for like sports and stuff and school clubs and stuff because why not? Like why not give it your 110%? I'm not gonna be those just trying to do the bare minimum students. I'm going to Mountain View College. It's a community college here in Dallas. It, um, I'm gonna go there and then transfer out and go to a university for my bachelor's degree. I don't know what uh, university yet, but I do know my degree that I wanna get. I want to get um, become a teacher, so I'm gonna get my early childhood education uh, degree in that. And I'm pretty excited about it. So I wanted to film this back to school haul and show you what I purchased for going back to school. The majority of it is just jeans because I went from working, you know, a corporate life to having like business dresses and maybe dresses and um, skirts and, you know, things like that that I could wear to work. And then um, summer, you know, I in during summer, I just purchased a lot of shorts, um, <clears throat> a lot of shorts. And um, I don't really want to start school wearing shorts. So I do have jeans obviously already <laughs> but I wanted to purchase a lot more um, jeans and just kind of um, things that were more school appropriate and not like summer that I don't have any makeup on don't judge me I'm just um, not wearing any makeup today <laughs> and uh, I'm kind of been doing that a lot this month but I am going to show you a back to school makeup routine um, that I'm going to upload on Tuesday I'm not going to upload a date night video because uh, I'm just gonna skip this week and show you my back to school and then I'll continue back with the date night. I need clothes to go back to school. So I wanna show you my back to school clothes and um, what I purchased. All right, so I'm gonna start with the pants. First pair of pants I got was actually these, I'm just gonna do this, um, were actually these um, black, skinny jeans. These are actually like a super skinny. Um, that's what they're called. They're from Calvin Klein and they're called the ultimate skinny. And they're just um, like super skinny through the leg and um, yeah. So these are the ones that I got. I got them in a size six and I actually got these at Costco for like 24 bucks. So I thought that was really good. And then the next pair I got were these from Michael Kors. I got these at Marshalls. They're size six as well. They're just really plain. They're very dark and they just have the little Michael Kors um, little leather logo there. And other than that, you couldn't tell, but all the detailing is gold, which I love. And these are like super dark. They almost look black on camera. Like next to my black ones, they look like, you know, very dark as well. And they're skinny, um, straight through the legs. And then um, these I got at Marshalls, I told you that. They were like 40 bucks, which I thought was a steal as well. And then um, these are all I got from New York and Company. These aren't jeans, they're a pair of those black, they're those tracksuit pants. But they have like this leather waist detail. It's faux leather. And they're from New York and Company. They were having a sale. I got them in size medium. They were having a sale. Buy one pair of jeans and get the other free. But these weren't along with that sale because these are not jeans. But um, I think they were like 24 bucks. I'm not too sure. But they do have these like um, horizontal strip zipper pockets in the front. And then that they have that... Um, tracksuit like sweatsuit pant detail and they look really really comfy I mean they're sweatpants to be honest okay and then um, another pair I got these these I got for half off these are some camo um, they say leggings so I'm gonna say leggings but they're like jean material although um, they the pockets they have back pockets 
which I think when they have back pockets, they're not leggings. So I really don't know. <laughs> um, but they don't have front pockets. Like this is not real. And then they do have a zipper and the button closure. So I don't know. But anyway, I got them in camel because it's super trendy right now. Um, these are a size four. And they are skinny as well. And I don't know. I just thought they would be um, super cute to wear. Um, you know, going back to school and stuff. Uh, were these kind of distressed in the front um, jeans. These are by New York and Company. And <clears throat> usually whenever I um, see jeans from there, they have a really higher waist. But these, these said they sit lower at the waist. These are in a size 6. And I can't remember how much these were, but I got them half off. And these are actually boot cut. So they're not skinny, but they're not like the super wide leg, which I'm looking for wider leg pants now. I think they're super in um, the wider the pant leg, the cuter to me. So yeah, these are boot cut because I just like that. I think it looks a lot more, just a lot nicer when you're wearing boots. And then um, that's it for the pants. I do have other pants that obviously I'm going to you know wear as well, but these are the, the ones that I got new. And then I got this shirt from New York and Company. It's super cute. It um, it's kind of like a bubble shirt, but it's in that plaid material. And let me show you like this. Um, the back is kind of sheer. It's a sheer material, but the front has like two um, like a you know two of them, and then the back has just that one. So it's a lot more sheer back there. But it definitely has that like bubble, you know, front thing. It's got like a wrap. I'll have to show you an outfit of the day wearing this. But yeah, I thought it was super cute. I didn't get it for 39 bucks. I think I got it on sale. So that was, that's good. I got these shoes. These are Vans. I have been wanting these for a while. I've already worn them. But um, these are in size 8. And they're the Leopard. Actually, these look more cheetah print. But yeah. I love these and I also got the socks to go with these I'll show you those these are the socks um, it's a three pack so you get um, like these little like floral ones then just some plain green ones and then these kind of tiger striped and then you got um, it was buy one get one half off so these were 13 bucks and then these were only like 650 and then these are like I want to say cheetah and then this is another like leopard print or whatever. And then I've already worn a pair because I've already worn these, but they were just um, striped. So yeah, these are the socks. And these socks um, have a wider opening. So it, like it covers or it doesn't show all of that. I mean, once you put it on your foot, it it's like to hear where the sock ends. So you don't see the sock at all, which is the point of these shoes, I think. Okay, and then um, a long time ago I bought this bag, but I wanted to show you anyway in case you're not the backpack wearing kind. You just want to like use a tote bag, which I don't recommend, but to each their own. I thought this was, was cute. It's by New York and Company too, and um, it's already got my stuff in there, but I really like this one. It's got like a faux leather material. I've been using this when I've been registering and... Um, you know going up to campus before for anything else now I'm gonna use my backpack but other than that I've been using this one so if it's like a light load day I might take this but it just depends and then I'll tell you about this planner which is amazing this is the day designer and it's by Whitney English and um, it's just like the best planner ever it has like the days broken down um, you could put like um, the top three and then what's due, how much dollars you have, what you're going to do for dinner, and then a don't forget. And then there's other to-dos. And then you break your day down by like 5 in the morning all the way to 9. And then down here it's like anything you want to download and then a daily gratitude. But it's like this for the whole day and then there's a monthly view. And I I've already filled this one with people's birthdays. Um, and then there's like your monthly to-dos 
And then over here, there's like goals for the month. I just think it's super cool. And what I think is most cool about this is that she has um, like a goal, um, like things to help you achieve your goals and make them more measurable. Like, yeah, it's super cool. So I got the gold foil one, um, striped one, but she has a black one black striped and then there's also she she just got a whole bunch of new um prints so love it if you are the backpack wearing kind i love this one i got it at target and it took me a very long time to decide on a backpack i had ordered one online but then it was on back order and it didn't come in so i went to target and i liked i liked this one so i went ahead and got it it has two outside pockets that are pretty roomy. It just looks like a good, like, utilitarian style bag. And then um, this one has, like, three little grommets here. They're just for show. They don't do anything else. But um, it also has, like, a little button closure there. And then a drawstring um, closure for, like... Keeping your things more secure and then I just got two plain black binders and then two of those spiral notebooks for each class because I'm taking four classes so and then right here I already bought my books these are the my four books that I have to take and then I want to show you my little book uh, my little pencil pouch because I thought it was super cute I got it at Target it's called it's from a brand called zip it and what I think was really cool about this is that it's, it was made from one long zipper. So if you follow this, and I did, because I wanted to make sure. Anyways, if you follow this zipper all across, it goes like it loops over and it comes back this way. And it loops over. It just is one large zipper, but it looks like a face. And then when you open it, here's the best part. It's like a face face. It's so cute. So yeah, in there I just um, got some highlighters and I really like these from Emphasis and I really like it because it just has this little thing here that's like fun to play around with. But they have all sorts of colors in the little packet and there's a pink one which I thought was very helpful when, you, when, it, um, when you're taking several different classes just to be able to take several different notes. And then the pins I got were these pins from Acrobaw from Pilot. And they're called Acrobaw. They're the color that the pin is. So this one's a purple one. This one's like this um, kind of orangey color. And then pink and green or teal and blue. This is actually not this color blue. It's like a dark navy blue, which I thought that was deceiving, but what ifs. Um, you have to buy these in packets of three, but I bought two packets of three and I have another purple one, but I didn't want to hold two purples. So those are my pins. And then I got these pencils. They're mechanical pencils. They're from Staples and they're called Postscript. They're just mechanical, but I really like that they're blue and there's like that soft, like poly material. I don't know what it is. And then I got... This Staples um, um, whiteout, or what is it called? Correction tape, which, yeah, I'm dealing with pins, so I'll need. But other than that, that's what's in the zip it case. It holds a lot more. It's just really um, sturdy. And I thought it was cool that it has a lifetime warranty. Oh, and I forgot to mention this thing here. This is a portable phone charger. I got it at Urban Outfitters and I thought it was super cool. My phone is always dying. I have an Android Galaxy S4. I don't know what it's called, but um, it is always on the verge of dying. So I bought this thing um, and you can connect either USB or the phone charger that I have which is this little guy right there I don't know if you can see but it also I think it works on iPhones too if not it's got the USB 
But anyway, you connect one to the bottom end, Back here. and then you connect this to my phone, and then you light this. And when it's blue, it means it's charging, and when it's red, it means it needs to be charged. I have found that this gives me one charge. Like this whole thing only gives my phone one complete charge. Today my phone was at 20% and I um, jumped it or charged it back up to about 99 and then this turned red. So um, you, I, I mean you do have to charge this every night but I mean my phone would have been dead half day if it wasn't for this thing. So I do uh, like this and I like the little chevron design so I got this at Urban Outfitters.